Venani says registering to vote is a declaration of people's collective will to shape the course of the nation. By casting ballots in November, voters will have the power to elevate PDM to the forefront of governance. As the Electoral Commission of Namibia embarks on its voter registration drive, let us not falter in our responsibility to participate in shaping our nation's future. For it is only through the power of our votes that we can usher in the change we so desperately see. He says for the past 34 years, PDM has been steadfast in its fight against corruption, adding that it has been the voice of the voiceless and the champion of the marginalized. According to him, PDM has been the beacon of hope for all who are seeking for a better tomorrow. The party, he said, is also the only stable political formation that can handle the highest office in the land. Our manifesto, soon to be unveiled, last night and this morning the party central committee was reviewing our draft manifesto that shows a commitment to the people of Namibia from tackling unemployment and housing shortages to revitalizing our healthcare system and education system. The PDM vision for a brighter future is bold, comprehensive and achievable. If voted to power, the party will ensure that agriculture flourishes and housing becomes a fundamental right and health care accessible to all. If PDM wins the November election, the economy will thrive, he promised, driven by strategic initiatives aimed at creating sustainable job opportunities and fostering economic growth in every corner of the nation, he says. Our government is going to build in the next five years three desalination plants. One desalination plant at Cape Frio, coming through Kunene region, Musati, going to Oshikoto. He then called on the people to embrace the opportunity of joining PDM to usher in a new era of progress, development and promise for the nation, knowing that the future of Namibia rests in his party's hands. He then announced that their Central Committee meeting resolved to hold an elective National Congress at Katima in Zambezi on the 8th to the 10th of August this year. Tonatenia Embody NBC News, Opuo.